Getting hat-trick in Australia is something for a spinner is, is more special than anything. It was like a dream day for me. You know, I never had in the mind that I will be taking a hat-trick in Australia. You know, it's fine if you get the hat-trick in Asia, in other countries, but in Australia, when it's tough for you to spin the ball, it's always difficult to get the hat-trick. We had a very low total on the board and when the batsman is not going to take too many risks on you, it's a bit difficult here to get his wicket. Then I said, like, no, I have to bowl the best deliveries. As long as I'm bowling my best deliveries, I have more chance to get the wickets. He has done an amazing job since I came here in debut for the Atlas Strikers. For the first day when I joined the team in the training, I bowled to him and the wicket was very turning as well and it, it was bouncy. So the way he kept that day against me, I was like, this guy is very special, you know. When he took my first catch, my first BBL wicket, that was the toughest catch and he took that. So I always have that belief in him, you know, behind the stump, he can take any catch, any stump of me. Can he survive this one delivery of the yeah. over? Oh. Oh. Too far, is it? Oh, got him! Given. He's got two in two! When I got two wickets, the best thing was I had a one hour gap. I was having this in the mind that what should I do in the next over for the first part, you know? Who will be on strike, either the sit batsman will be there, or a new batsman. But when, when I came to bowl, I had this in the mind that it doesn't matter whoever is betting, if I hit the right area, right, right lane, I think I can get him. And uh, that's what happened, you know, I made the movie in my mind, suppose it's a pitch it here, I get a bit of turn, that might help me a lot. Here we go, on a hat trick. The moment I released that from my hand, I was like, yes, I got it. Batsman like Silk, he's already batting there and then you're getting his wicket on a hat-trick ball uh, was awesome feeling, you know, I was just like, what just happened? You know, I got a hat-trick in, in Australia. I was like, this is the best time as long I can go. You know, I wanted to go even to the fans as well. But uh, Harry Conway was there, he just stopped me there. <laughs> And more than the hat-trick, what I loved the most after the game was the commentary. You know, those three legends, Simons, Britley and Gilly, I think. I heard their, their, their commentary, how, how they uh, enjoyed that hat-trick was an unbelievable. And uh, I kept watching that commentary again and again. And still, you know, when I'm in my room, having a game tomorrow, I just go there again and I watch that hat-trick. So that gives me lots of energy. Khan. He is unstoppable. What a player.